Hello everyone and welcome back. So today I have a 30 minute full body workout for you. It's suitable for beginners and also for those who just want a short workout on a busy day. So we have a total of 6 sections in this workout. Upper body, plank, lower body, glute bridges, abs and cardio. So let's start with the first exercise which is back extensions. Make sure to fix your gaze at the ground to keep your neck in a neutral position. Up next, back extensions with arm reach outs. So just a heads up, we're going to be doing several variations of laying back extensions. So for every rep, train yourself to use mind muscle connection, focus on your back muscles and squeeze them with all you've got. Feel free to use this short break to stretch out your body a little. Moving on, we have alternative back extensions with arm reach outs. Five seconds left, you're halfway through, so keep pushing. Next exercise, snow angels. Shine bright up all night, whenever slow. Keep in mind that you are supposed to be using your back muscles instead of momentum to lift your upper body for every rep. Gotta keep this feeling, keep on Next, we're going to reach our arms to the back, holding them together and engage our back muscles to lift our upper body up. We're going to hold it here for 45 seconds. Try to fix your gaze down on your mat, focus and breathe through it. Running wild, can't come down, my head is in the clouds. Gotta keep 
We're gonna have a 30 seconds break soon. Next exercise is Superman hold. We're almost there, 20 more seconds to go, so hold it strong. For the second section of this workout, I have prepared a mini plank challenge for you. So 30 seconds each exercise, no rest in between. Starting with basic plank, so you're going to keep your core tight, body in a straight line, eyes looking down at your mat. about 10 seconds we're gonna switch to plank hip dips Moving on to plank arm reach out. Next exercise, dolphin plank. Halfway through this mini plank challenge, you're doing a great job here. Next exercise, commandos. Switching over to shoulder taps in 5 seconds. Up next, plank arm rows. <laughs> 
Next, we have our last exercise and a 60 seconds break after. So we're gonna lower our bodies down, keeping it in a straight line, and then on your knees, push yourself back up. Engage your abs and exhale as you lower yourself down towards the mat. So now we're going to have a 60 seconds break. Next, we're going to focus on lower body 45 seconds with 15 seconds rest in between. I hope you enjoy your break. We're going to be starting our third section of this workout with sumo squats. Try your best to move at a constant pace. Focus on your glutes to push yourself up to a standing position. Next exercise, sumo squat pulses. Keep pulsing and breathe through it. We're almost done here. <music> Moving on, we have more sumo squat pulses coming along. This time, two reps followed by calf raises. Next exercise, alternative lunge pulses, two reps for each side.
next exercise, we have lunge pulses, two reps, followed by a kickback. We're targeting a lot of glutes here, so you're going to be using your glute muscles to push yourself up and you're going to squeeze them for every rep of kickback. Switch over to the other side. We're going to have a 30 seconds break soon, so push through these 20 seconds. halfway through this 30 minute full body workout. Next, I have a mini glute bridge challenge for you. 30 seconds, no rest in between. Lay down on your mat, rest a bit and get ready for glute bridges. Keep in mind not to overarch your back when lifting up. Next exercise, still continuing with glute bridges, but your feet are going to be on your heels. In about 10 seconds, we're going to switch over to single leg glute bridges. Next, we're going to hold in our single leg glute bridge position for 30 seconds. We're going back to glute bridges for our next exercise. Up next, tiptoed glute bridges. Up next, 
Three more exercises to go. Next exercise, single leg glute bridges. before we're going to be holding it there for 30 seconds as you can see my legs are feeling tired here but let's try our best to push our hips up and keep it strong next Glute bridge hold. This is our final exercise for this mini glute bridge challenge, so hold it there, 10 seconds left. our fifth section of this workout abs so 45 seconds with 15 seconds rest in between first exercise leg raises make sure to keep your entire back in contact with your mat by engaging your abs there shouldn't be any spaces in between and this should be maintained throughout the exercise Searching for higher ground Can't see in front of me My enemies have tried every possibility Ability to know if I can bleed If that's what you wanted You won't get it tonight Cause I can fly Continuing with more leg raises, but this time there's going to be a slight variation. If you're feeling more tension in your quads, try to bend your knees a little and shift the focus back onto your lower abs. Moving on, we're going to be doing a jackknife variation. Yeah. Similar 
a lot of leg raises, you're gonna try your best to keep your back in contact with the mat by engaging your abs. There shouldn't be any spaces in between. This is really important for most of the laying on your back ab exercises. Next exercise, in and out. We're gonna have more in and outs, but this time we're gonna focus more on your obliques. So tilt right a little and squeeze them with every rep. Now let's switch over to the other side, we're going to be targeting our left obliques. Halfway there, 20 more seconds to go until a 30 seconds rest. Now let's stand back up onto our feet and get ready for cardio. 30 seconds for each exercise, 15 seconds rest in between. First exercise, jumping jacks. Moving on to your high knees to jumping jacks, I would give it about 4 to 5 reps for each.
continuing with the high knees, but this time, instead of a jumping jack, we're gonna do it with burpees. Make it last forever, stop in time. Yeah, I'm surrendering. Hold tight, hold tight. Chemicals collide. Hold tight, hold tight, hold tight. Dripping light. Now more burpees coming along. Next, burpees to squats. At our second final exercise, burpees to mountain climbers. So this is really our final exercise for this workout. So let's push through it for another 30 seconds. Mountain climbers, let's do it. Three, two, one, and workout finally completed. As mentioned before, you can squeeze this workout in on a busy day. It's also suitable for beginners, and being able to move sweat is better than doing nothing. So I hope you enjoy this workout session. Be sure to give this workout video a like, subscribe to my channel, Check out my other videos as well, such as what I eat and more other varieties coming soon. So I try my best to post a new video every Wednesday, so stay tuned for that. And thank you for working out with me. I'll see you in your next workout session. Bye!